Hi guys. Well, it is a rainy, ugly, just slit your wrist kind of day here. And uh, on Sunday, September 5th, 2021. And guys, I have, I have to admit, Alistair, brother Alistair, he has been working for years. Since the day he met me, he says he has never trusted me. And uh, he has made some quite pointed accusations at me, but it has now happened. He has been rummaging through the doomosphere, and Brother Alistair says, Hambone, you are busted. I have blown your cover. This whole Humpty Dumpty tribe stuff, so I admit it, guys. I, I have to come clean. This is not Humpty Dumpty tribe. This is the Humpty Dumpty Institute. Yes, Hambone Little Tail is one of the uh, head movers and shakers of the Humpty Dumpty Institute. And now that Alistair has blown my cover, anyway, I might as well cough it up. So what is my mission here at the Humpty Dumpty Institute? To inform and foster dialogue among critical stakeholders on key global issues. Yes, Alistair, you have busted me. Humpty Dumpty engages critical stakeholders through its programs with the U.S. Congress and the United Nations, including organizing visits of congressional delegations overseas and to the United Nations, and through its engagement with business and cultural leaders around the world. Yes, Humpty Dumpty collaborates with partner organizations to engage young people on global issues, e.g. Humpty Dumpty's annual United Nations Boot Camp, bringing students from around the world to the United Nations. Yes. Humpty Dumpty supports cultural diplomacy. Humpty Dumpty has worked with U.S. embassies and international cultural organizations worldwide to engage people through music, arts, and sports, e.g. its training program for young filmmakers from crisis countries. <laughs> in partnership with the UCLA School of Theater, Film, and Television. All right. Humpty Dumpty conceives, develops, and facilitates humanitarian programs with partners, e.g. supporting the removal of landmines and unexploded bombs in Sri Lanka, distribution of footwear, Yes, distributions of footwear to vulnerable communities in Vietnam and support for mobile medical vehicles in Lesotho. Who are Humpty Dumpty's partners? Humpty Dumpty's partners include the U.S. Congress, the United Nations, the U.S. Department of State, the U.S. Department of Agriculture, various countries, celebrities, educational institutions, the private sector, and a host of other NGOs. But it is mainly a United Nations front. So Alistair has done some digging. So who are the uh, the movers and shakers on the Humpty Dumpty Institute, the board of directors. Well, of course, we have Walter Simon Arbib. Walter Simon Arbib is the president. Yes. Uh, I uh, guess of uh, the Humpty Dumpty Tribe Institute. No, I'm sorry. Walter Simon Airbib 
thought it said Airbnb, is the president of Skylink groups of companies and founder and director, Skylink Aviation Incorporated has become a leader in fast global deployment of food, peacekeepers, and humanitarian aid. But it obviously is not the one. It is not uh, Simon Airbib that Alistair has burned. It is Reverend Samuel Mitchell here on the Humpty Dumpty Drive Institute Board of Directors, the other mover and shaker. Samuel Mitchell is the voice of the Dumasphere, spreading New World Order depopulation propaganda to the masses. The former editor of the Chicken Little Society and leader of the Humpty Dumpty tribe, Samuel's latest project is to appeal to the normies through his Collapse Chronicles project. Yes, the Reverend Samuel Mitchell, Doomsday Prophet, yes, sharing uh, the directorship of the Humpty Dumpty Tribe Institute with Walter Yes, moving the fast global deployment of food, peacekeepers, and international humanitarian aid, I guess in that order, you know, but I have been found out. So uh, I did ask Alistair how he ratted me out, and this was his answer. Okay. So, Alistair, how did you figure it out? Alistair told me, with enough time mucking around in the rumor sphere, one learns a lot. So, anyway, I'm just as glad to, uh, to have been exposed. You know, living this lie for 12 years, uh, living this lie for 12 years here but I have been exposed by Alistair for what I truly am and uh, what was that I've already forgotten what I truly am I am Reverend Samuel Mitchell is the voice of the Dumasphere spreading New World Order depopulation propaganda to the masses. That is exactly what I am. And as long as I've been burned, I am a proud, unapologetic, and unrepentant propagandist for the New World's Order depopulation agenda. And uh, <laughs> I'm still waiting for my first check. For 12 years of hard work, I have been schlepping for the United Nations, uh, you know, disseminating their New World Order depopulation propaganda to the masses. And you, you can see what it has bought me. Uh, <laughs> this is what I have to show for it. Anyway, get out there and disseminate your own uh, New World Order depopulation agenda to the masses from the United Nations while you still can. And long live the Georgia Guidestones. Bye, guys. So, Alistair, uh, I found somebody else to help me move those rocks out of the creek. So, we now have the newest member stepping up to the plate. Brother Quincy uh, arrived, saw my plea. So, uh, we have more rocks out of the creek. 
I need to get back to building a stairway to nowhere. Bye guys.